Hello, I'm Tom Lodziak. Today, I'm here with top coach and pro player, Craig Bryant. In this video, Craig is gonna teach us how to do backhand serves. He's gonna show us the technique for backspin serves, side spin serves, and top spin serves. And he's gonna explain how we can use backhand serves effectively in matches. So, if you wanna get good at doing backhand serves, then keep watching. This video is brought to you in partnership with Brybar Table Tennis. Visit brybartt.co.uk today for a wide range of rubbers, blades, bats, balls and clothing from all your favourite table tennis brands. Okay, so the backhand serve um, is another variety of service. The more variety in, in your serve you've got, the more difficult it can be for your opponent. Uh, so the backhand serve can sometimes allow you to reach different parts of the table that maybe you can't on the forehand. So for example, if I was going to serve my reverse serve down the line, I'm having to contort myself into quite an uncomfortable position to create that positioning on the table. If I step across and face that side, then it's a little bit easier, a little bit more natural to be able to get the, the ball into that short forehand. So there are benefits to, to opening up different angles of play with the backhand serve. So I tend to stand slightly this side of, uh, of the middle line. That's a bit of personal preference. Have a little play around with where is comfortable for you. And I tend to stand slightly side on. So that when I'm swinging, I've got this room here for a backswing. If I'm stood a bit square, then sometimes you can get in the way. So I stand a little bit more side on, and that gives me a little bit more room to execute the serve. I throw the ball up my arms coming back up towards my shoulder and then I'm looking to contact the ball in front of me here and then my back is just finishing upwards and to the side. So, to get clean backspin, we're looking to flatten the bat and we're looking to contact the front part of the racket and we're hitting completely underneath the ball. Okay, so that's, that's how you get the backspin on the ball. Uh, the limitation with that is that it's very obvious that you're creating backspin. For me, a, a personal preference would be to use side spin and backspin. So I'm adopting this more side on position and I'm looking to create backspin and side spin by hitting the bottom part of the racket and I'm contacting the ball on the way down. For side spin, we're looking to contact slightly later, not quite on the way down, but just in this part here where we're just starting to pull across, still on the bottom of the racket, but we're looking to pull more across. And again, we, hopefully you can see that ball just moving there. So before I've pulled up, Backspin on the way down, side spin just slightly on the way across, and the top spin is in that latter part of the phase of the stroke. So it's down, and we're just looking to contact more middle of the racket, and it's on the way up.
So we're contacting the ball in these different phases of the stroke. The stroke should all look fairly similar and that was, that's what makes the serve tricky to read. So just because I'm setting myself up in this way to take advantage of this uh, a right-hander's forehand side doesn't mean that I can't serve short to the backhand or long to the backhand. I would just be taking the, the contact slightly later to create that wider angle. So still use all of the table, um, but the short forehand is not a bad place to start. Thank you very much for watching and big thanks to Craig Bryant for sharing his service tips. If you want more information about Craig and his coaching services, go to Craig's website at topedgetabletennis.co.uk. Also thanks to the sponsor of this video, Breibard Table Tennis. Um, if you like the video, please subscribe. I've got many more videos coming soon. I'll see you then. Bye bye.